Well, we got our Walmart delivery. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. We got uh, oranges, grapes, broccoli, asparagus, cucumbers, bananas, chips, bread, some meat, milk, half and half, tortillas, and I'm going to wash my stuff. So here's what I do. Uh, this is uh, bleach water, and uh, I spray these things. And let me put this camera down over here. So I'm rubbing these real good and don't give me a bad time about not wearing gloves. These hands will not be touching any other part of my body until they... Plus, this is bleach. And then uh, I rinse them. I rinse these. This is just fresh water. It's actually bottled water. And I set them in here on the counter I've already uh, bleached in order to dry. Half and half. Tortillas. chips uh, raspberry jelly and some pickles Cup of soup. Don't need those parts. Lynn can't be out here because uh, the smell of the bleach does her in. Hamburger buns. Bread. Those I'm not going to dip in the water because it's a cardboard box. Put them back out there in the sunshine. And I smell the water to see how bad it's getting. I'll probably double rinse some of these things because the water gets bleachy.
Matter of fact, I'm going to change how I'm doing this. This water has gotten very bleachy, so I'm going to dump it out. I'm not dumping it on the grass. I'm going to dump it on the sidewalk. <laughs> so, I've revised my plan here. Uh, I'm going to double rinse them, and the first rinse is with water out of the garden hose. We don't usually rinse things with anything other than bottled water. Uh, when we're just normally rinsing vegetables and stuff. But, I don't want to use up all my bottled water. Who knows when they might stop delivering that. So, I'm going to double rinse. The first one here is in uh, water out of the hose, and the second rinse will come with clean water, clean bottled water. So that's how we're doing it. Getting all of the, I wasn't getting all of the bleach off of these things. Plus, I now have fairly hot water because it came out of the hose, which is in the sun. We always wash our vegetables in bleach water. So, this part of it isn't going to be anything different other than I would usually just use bleach water. And these bags are staying out and going in the trash. The bananas this time are open on the ends, which I'm not real crazy about. And when I'm at the store, I get green bananas. These look like I'm going to have to eat them today. When I shop myself, I'm very particular about the cucumbers and the oranges and the tomatoes that I buy. And, uh, one of the downsides here is that that's not possible. And you don't always get uh, the freshest or the best out of the bin. The broccoli looks really good. The asparagus is a uh, like I said, I would have picked a different bunch. So, bleach water. Boy, I hate to do that to the broccoli, but I'm doing it. So, those are all rubbed with the bleach good. Somebody's going to ask me in a comment, uh, how much bleach did I put in that water? Uh, about a third bleach and a third water, and uh, my test is that it feels slimy on my hands. <laughs> it stinks so bad that Lynn might be out here while I do it. 
bring the meat packages also. Uh, cardboards and plastics are going to the trash. Clean water for the plants. Bleachy water for the sidewalk. So somebody is going to tell me that this is overkill. Better safe than sorry. I don't mind doing it. Uh, and by the way, the ungloved hands. This is slimy beach water. And I'm going to go in the house and rinse them in the sink. And dry with a paper towel before I come and turn off my camera. like me, give me one of those thumbs up and please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.